Hi, I'm Jack Geldard. Welcome to Epic TV Climbing Daily. Today we're talking about the Bouldering World Cup. It's just been in Vale in the USA. And we're also talking about a short but intense new route in North Wales. So some big news from Vale over in Colorado. The Bouldering World Cup results. Anna Stoa from Austria took first place, as did Dmitry Sharafutdinov from Russia. Both of these climbers, despite the competition not having finished for the season, they've both now won the overall World Cup. There's only been five rounds so far. There's one more round in a couple of months' time in Germany. No one can beat them, so it doesn't matter what happens in Germany later in the year, they're going to be the overall World Cup winners for 2013. Vale was an exciting final. You can watch all the replays online in this IFSC video. The rocky coastline of North Wales has got loads of climbing, both traditional and sport. One of the sport venues there is called Pigeon's Cave, it's on the Great Orm near Clandidno. It's a really steep but very small and tidal sport climbing venue and Pete Robbins, one of the strongest local climbers, he's just added a new route, he's called Pump Up The Jam. It's a really short kind of overhanging wall following a crack line, he's graded at 8C, it's taken him a year or so to climb this, it's super hard, you can check out more information on Doylo's local climbing blog for this. Loads of information there, all going on in the North Wales scene at the moment. The weather's been really good there. Pete's sandwich is making me pretty hungry, so I'm off for lunch. But tomorrow, we've got more news on Epic TV Climbing Daily. And remember, if you've got something you want to see on the show, get in touch with us on Facebook and Twitter.